I, I was supposed to try to start a conversation with you. Just don't you know how rude that is? You, you ran away from me when I was trying to talk to you, man. Hello everyone, it's Guitar here back and welcome to episode 2 of Let's Play Chrono Trigger. In the last episode, we had to chase Marley, Marley, into this, this place that I don't know where we are. And now, uh, these guys, these guys, simple enemies, they die with basically one hit, they, they're just, they're just born to die basically. Yeah, yeah, I don't know what I'm talking about anyway. Yeah. Just go away, just go away, thank you, thank you very much. Now, if you remember from last episode when we fought Gato, Gato, <laughs> all these, all these accents are coming up with I don't know. Uh, we earn technique points, as you see there, three technique points. And if we get enough of the, enough of the, enough of the, yes, enough of those. If we get enough of those, uh, if we look in text, we need one more technique point to get this, this technique here, Cyclone. Um, uh, yeah, I'll just I'll just show you that that's that's good. Uh, I'll show you what that's useful for in a moment when we when we get enough technique points, which is, should be well, we only need one, so that'll be enough here. So yes, kill you, I kill you. Hey. There we go, two technique points and Chronos level increase, Chronos load cyclone. Nice, that's all we need. So. This chest here, potion, and this chest down here has a power glove. I wonder if this was a like a, a nod to the the um, the you know the the peripheral that Nintendo came out with that was very bad. The, that was the the power glove or whatever the hell it was called. I can't remember. Yeah, you know, uh, I don't know what I was. Uh, but anyways, now Cyclone. Wall about enemies striking others nearby. This is useful for when you have two or more enemies clumped together. So, let's see if I can show this here. Tech. Cyclone. So, the middle one here. And we can see it, it affects all the enemies in the surrounding area of that, of that, that enemy I can't remember the name of. We're only thinking of the wiki. Three there any points. What did I go? Yes. Let's, let's just go out here. Oh, wait, wait, first, first. This is the DS version. I, I have to. I have. I, my OCD is kicking in. I have to. I have to, to explore all the map. All the map must be explored. No map must be left unexplored. I don't know what I'm talking about here. I'm just. Kuno has OCD. Don't you, don't you know? There we go. Everything should be. Everything should be explored now. Okay. Hey, it's all foggy now. Yes, yes. Okay, so few differences. There's no millennial fair and our house is missing. Something fishy going on here. Residents, let's see what's uh, hey locals. Locals. Talk to them. Purple land woman. A millennial fair? Here? Have you been in your cups? Our kingdom is only six hundred years old. King Guardia the twenty first is still range last I checked. Ah, we're in the past, eh? I scarcely remember the days before the war against the Fiend Lord began. The months turned to years. When will this all end? Ah, uh, it'll end in my... Well, judging by my mathematics. I'm rubbish at maths, by the way. Judging by my mathematics, it should be gone about, like, 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 like less than 400 years. That, that's... Anyone can do that, you know. You didn't come all this way just to look, did you? Surely there's something you'd like to buy. Let's see, what do you have? Uh, I'll need some shelters. These shelters fully restore HP and MP at a save point, so that'll be useful. Bronze blade, we could get that if we had enough things. So we can sell stuff. If we sell the hide cap that we don't need and the hide tunic that we don't need. Uh, bronze blade, yeah, why not? Equip. There we go. My thanks, do come again. Uh, what do you say? So you have a mind to buy some weapons and join the fight against the Fiend Lord's army, have you? Wonderful! 
Also remember to equip the weapons you buy, not much meaning else wise. I don't know why I don't know why I'm putting like diff, different like like uh, accents of like the UK in this area. Uh, so that's that's what it seems to be happening now. Uh, yeah. These these guys uh spoilers they're they 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 uh what's the, what's the word? Uh not descendants, uh non ascendants. What's the what's the word? Whatever it is. Uh the they they related to Luca in the in the before Luca. I don't know. No, no. I'm Banza, the village blacksmith. I'm forging this mirror in the Queen's behest as a symbol of its love for Queen Lane. The Queen's fellowship act had me wondering if all this work had been for naught. After all, what's the bell without a queen, eh? But it seems they found her in the canyon up north. She's back in the castle now, and I'm back to work. So yes, yes, just just hammering a bell all day, every day. My husband wants a daughter both clever and fair. Yes, there's there's further in uh, the West word I'm uh, looking for. I can't remember the words. Words. English. Yeah, yeah. Ah, uh, that just, that proves they're the the distant relatives, uh, whatever the words are, of Luca and 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 Taban, Taban. Yeah, words. Okay, so up here, where well, we've already been up here. Yeah, the 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 market we've already been in. Yeah, we need to choose in. So I need healing. Yeah, yeah, I need healing. Okay. Uh, how much money do I have? Twenty-four gold. Ten gold for the night. Good. I'm gonna stay here. So we all healed up and ready to go now. So, first of all, let's talk to the these people. Hey, you alcoholic guy. Fine, you don't want to talk to me. Okay, never mind. Okay, now. Fair, have you gone mad? This is no time for mirth and memory. Yes, yes. You, Albert guy. Well, are you, you say? You're sort of some sort of simpleton? Even a half witch know this is the land of Guardia. Our kingdom wages war with the Fiend Lord's army day and night, fighting to restore the realm's peace. Pray tell you do that much at least. Of, of course, of course. <laughs> then might to you show us the good grace to stop wandering around pesting the ring folk with moronic questions. Eh. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, praise me, they found Queen Lean wandering up in the canyon. She'll be missing for so long, I feared the worst. She must be back in the castle by now, getting some much-needed rest. Eh, yeah, someone's coming into the bar. We're just talking to strangers, it seems. There seems to be a thing going on here. We're talking to strangers. You're an outsider too? The name's Toma. I'm an explorer. And if you can spare ten gold to buy this round, I'll be a storyteller too. What do you say? Oh, I have enough money. Another mug! There we go. Cheers, friend. Well, then a promise is a promise. It's about the missing queen. My travels have taken me to the cathedral in the western wood, and there's something most peculiar about that place. It's, it's only a hunch, but... Beg your pardon? They found Queen Lee in the canyon? Hmm, it seems my suspicions were misplaced. Yeah, yeah, I don't, I don't know. I, I keep doing different accents and stuff. You don't you know what I'm talking about, don't you know? Ah. Uh, anyways, down here we can see the bridge is broken. Yes. Hey, hey, bro. The Fiend Lord's army laid waste to this bridge. We're working to repair it, but until Sir Cyrus returns, we must see to the kingdom's defense as well. Yeah. Now, if you've played only the Super Nest version before, um, then you'll notice there's some, uh, or Super Nest version or the PS1 version, which I, I feel sorry for you if you've played the PS1 version, because that the load times on that are just ridiculous. Anyways. Uh, if you played only the one of those two versions, then you'll notice the translations are slightly different. They've improved the translations on the DS version, so, you know, there's that. Anyways, we're going to go into the Gandia Forest, which we didn't actually go into. I should have gone into in 1000 AD. Hey, these guys, these guys. Just green, green versions. Uh, leprechauns or something, I don't know. Not a leprechaun, uh, whatever. Um, but... What'll happen here is, if I, because uh, there's a few fights in this, in this forest, if there's fights that involve uh, enemies we haven't seen before, I'll leave them in. If there's fights involving uh, enemies we've seen before, then I'll just, I'll just cut them out. 
Uh, there's a, a few imps and the roly thingy manuikis that I just killed there. Uh, so I'll just skip those when we come across them. Because we've already seen these. You know. They're self-explanatory. You hit them and they die. And the next week is where I Okay. Motion, nice. So, over here. Strength capsule. Capsule. Yeah. And down here there is an enemy thingy. With two of these guys. Uh, rad uh, I can't remember these. Are these Radillos? Radillo riders, yeah. Uh, I need to wait for them to get closer. Get closer. Get clo Ah, screw it. Just, just screw it. I wanted them to get closer, but they, they wouldn't listen, man. There seems to be a theme in my videos where I keep changing accents like every two minutes. I hope people find it funny. I, I bet they don't, but you know. <laughs> uh, they're, they're like, I, it's not funny. What, what are you talking about? It's, it's not funny. Why do why, why, why you keep going on about this? Why do you keep changing accents? Anyways. Uh, in 1000 AD, there'd be a uh, speed capsule, I think, up here. I'm trying to remember stuff that I haven't played this game in a while. Uh, whatever. And up here... Ah, ah, past this, past this, let's just skip this battle. As I was going to say, up here there is a shaking bush. If we click on it, this guy, koala guy, comes out. An enemy drops a shelter, yes. If you exit and enter the forest, still will reappear back. So you basically have infinite shelters. Now if we go down here, there is more enemies down here. Bird, bird, eagle thingies. Uh, blue eaglets. I'm sorry, all these, all these names. Like Pokemon. Great, I'm not going to hit multiple of them. Great. Why are things moving? Come on, you should be able to hit that thing. I swear. All your jittery animations. And I'm almost dead. Great. 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 I am almost dead. There we go. Okay, now, it's probably a good time to use a potion right now. Uh, two potions, you know, it's because YOLO, YOLO man. Okay, so there's a, another few, ing no, not English, these guys, we'll just skip this fight. Okay, so. We haven't explored the whole map yet, but we'll come. We'll be going back down here in a, later um, after we come back out of this castle, because we're going to Cardia Castle. So let's go in. Halt! Who goes there? I've not seen your face before. I those outlandish clothes wouldn't be one of the Feelord's agents, would we? Ha! Ah, fat chance. Look at him. That boy's not built to lift a sword, let alone serve in the Feelord's army. Eh, yeah, suppose you're right. Now run along, boy, before I lock, forced to lock you up in the towers. Stop that at once. Quilene. That man is my friend, and you will treat him as such. But, your majesty, there is something strange about his look. Oh, uh, testifying against the queen. You refuse to obey my orders? No, no, I, I forgive me, my lady. Please enter. Ah, uh, this, 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 but this person, this person looks familiar. This person. Okay, okay. Well, what, what do you have to say now? Now you've been scolded by the queen. Please pardon us. We have no idea that you were her majesty's guest. Actually, I don't know either, so. I envy you to be favored by the queen. Yes, yes, sure you do. King Guy in the 21st century, an audience within. Be mindful of your place. Yes, yes, all this, all this. Hey, King, King, bro, bro. I am to understand that you played some role in helping to rescue my lady wife. I owe a debt of gratitude. Might you know what have befell in? She has been acting rather oddly since her return, and she seems to have lost the coral hairpin that she always wore. She always treasured that thing, so... Forgive me, you must be tired. Please rest in the knight's quarters downstairs to the left. I'll speak to the commander. Yeah, so if we need to heal, we can go downstairs to the left. Yeah. It sounds like some sort of a 
of like a tour. And on your left, you can see the stairs to ways to hell. Yes, yes. And on your right, you can see a, a lava lake. Yes, yes. I don't know what I'm talking about here. Ah, uh, whatever. There's this guy. Gandalf guy. Gandalf. Hey, what's up? What's up, bro? Hmm. Great. You, you don't approve of my shenanigans, do you? You like my account picture? Yes. Okay, never mind. Hey, what do you have to say? The king's chambers are atop the tower head. The knight's quarters are downstairs. Go straight from here and you'll find the stairway on the left. Ah, uh, direction, guys, yes. So, up here, let's follow the, 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 the Gandalf guy. Hey, chest. 100 gold. Yes, they just leave gold lying around. I swear, these, these guys, these guys. Bro, bro. Eh. What do you want? Be gone from here. Eh, fine, fine. You, I, I was trying to start a conversation with you. Just don't you know how rude that is? You you ran away from me when I was trying to talk to you, man. Come on. Anyways. Over here, King's Quarters. Let's just take. Let's just loot his stuff. Bronze armor. We, do we actually have that? No, we can. We can replace it. There we go. That's better. Bronze armor. So, let's go down to the the kitchens, I guess. Although I have it set up so, like, if I go like. Diagonally, it seems to go faster than than if I just go sideways or whatever. So here you can get free food, Ether. So you and your Majesty are with the Queen are uh, acquainted. Yes, maybe, maybe. What does it matter to you? What does it matter to you? Anyways, ah, uh, I order a meal. What will you have? Uh, refreshing salad will heal the MP, magic points, powers to HP, and spice roast both. Spice roast, we, we don't have to pay for anything then, it's on the house. And look at his face, look at his face, look at his face, okay. Jesus, we, they expect us to eat just that, and it's just me. Wow. HP and MP is restored. Yeah. So, actually, actually, if we, there's a funny thing, if we talk to, um, uh, the chef will hear a funny thing here. I've become the season, my broth, with your lack of culinary experience. Out, you are no place in my kitchen. Oh, what in the name of all that's good is this ice cream that Her Majesty so wishes I prepare. Uh, <laughs> I've never heard of ice cream. I, yes, yes. Middle Ages, Middle Ages people. Ah, ah, ah. Gold armor, dude. And there's knights. Of the square table. I don't know. The, the rectangular table. Where's our food and drink? Oh, Commander. Thank you, pardon. There's not quite many. My men and I risk our lives in this war. Is it so much that you are uh, that, that ask that you keep us fed? Quickly now. Enough of yourself, righteous ranting. You knights aren't the only ones putting your lives on the line for this kingdom. Huh, I think I've lost my appetite. I've no stomach for me braised in cowardice. See that my men are fed. Oh, he's got told. Oh, oh. Go find someone else to command. I don't need you telling me how to do my job. Eh, uh, whatever. So, dude, he's always like this. Our oh, commander is a good man, the master of kitchen but runs in the wrong is that is that a typo or is that just I don't know. I don't know if that's a typo or if that's just how it's supposed to talk. The master of kitchens butt rubs him in the butt that, that sounds wrong. That's oh, oh if you say that out loud it just sounds wrong. The master of the kitchens butt rubs him the wrong way. <laughs> and then Crono was just blinking like what the hell did I just hear? Our new commander is working hard to fill Sir Cyrus's shoes. Ah. So. Ooh, we are done here, basically. We have a fellow and stuff. So, we are going to go up to the, the Queen's Quarters. Up here. 
And there's a chest here with potion. And up here, there we go. Hey, bro. Her Majesty awaits you. Yeah, she's so swaggy. He, he's one of the only NPCs to step backwards. Backwards. Yeah. Okay. Let's take the chest first. Obtain ether. Hey, hey, hey. It's been over 10 years since Her Majesty first came to this castle, but she's scarce aged a day. In fact, she looks even younger now than she did before her disappearance. Oh, the suspecting stuff. You're the one who said that, Queen? I expected one to be a bit more dashing. Come on. You look like my mother, except, except purple hair. Yes, yes, okay. Ah, there you are. Please leave us. I need to have words with this man in private. As you wish, Your Majesty. Majesty, Majesty. <laughs> Come nearer. Don't be shy. The, the music, man. I, 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 feel, I, I, I don't know. Yeah, it's great. <laughs> Fooled you, didn't I, Chrono? It's me. But everyone keeps calling me lead for some reason. I'm glad you came. We were only together for that short time at the fair, but somehow I knew you'd come for me. Thank you, Chrono. What's happening? Yeah, things are going wrong again, aren't they? Chrono doesn't know a thing. I feel... I feel like I'm being torn apart. Help me, Connor. I'm scared. It's like I'm dying. Please, Connor, help. Great, she keeps disappearing. Stop the bloody, bloody internet connection. Stop disappearing. <laughs> Anyways. Yeah. Her Majesty dismissed you already. You didn't engage in any... Untoward behavior, did you? Of course not. What are you talking about? Let's just hope that is the case. By the way, did Her Majesty seem somehow not herself? Yeah. Just as I thought. She claims she's not mean and there's something something different about her. Oh, but don't let one of us escape. Eh, you, you surrounded by women. How do you feel? A great number of things change as the years go by. But if there is one thing that will never be the same, it's women and their insufferable love of gossip. Ah, I see, I see what you did there. I see what you mean there. Okay, let's go downstairs. Chrono! Hey, how the hell did you get in here? You have even even weirder fashion sense than mine. <sighs> You're okay. Did you find the girl? She what? She disappeared? Uh, it's just as I thought then. I knew I recognized her from somewhere. We seem to be a Guardian, but it looks a lot older than the Guardian we're from. You must have mistaken that girl for her ancestor. After all, that girl was our Princess Narnia. She was what? My god, blood twist. Marl, that is, Princess Narnia is a descendant of Queen Lean. Queen was kidnapped and someone was supposed to have gone and saved her, but now history has been changed. This is actually a clever way of explaining how the grandfather paradox happens, if it were to happen. Marl looks so much like the Queen that they probably call off their search when she appeared, but if the real Queen is killed, then none of the others will, will have happened. She will never get given birth to the other ones. Marl will never have existed, but there might still be enough time. If we can save the Queen, history as we know it should remain unchanged. Something must happen to the Queen in this area if she isn't rescued. And if something happens to her, her descendant Princess Nadia will never come into being. We have to find the real Queen. I remember there was a line in the, um, in the Super NES version, um, it was when she's when Luke is explaining the grandfather paradox with how if if the uh, the earlier 
member of the family is killed, then the later, the descendants will never come into being. It's it the way they worded it. Uh, I didn't understand it at first. Plus the fact that I was like 12 when I first played it. Maybe actually no, younger than that. Whatever it was. Um, the way it worked. Let me just run away from these guys. I mean, I somewhat understood it. That just it, it, just the way it was explained. It just didn't quite click. That the, the, the what it meant exactly. If you know what I mean. Because it mentioned go ahead, these guys again. See, in this, in the DS re-release, it said Mal will, uh, will never have existed. Mal will never have existed if the real queen is killed. But in the, in the original Super NES version, it said if the real queen is killed, Mal will simply disappear. Now, obviously that means it'll disappear from the fabric of space and time, or whatever it was. But, you know, it's just, uh, just the way it's, uh, you know, me and my prepubescent, you know, well, not prepubescent, but, you know, younger. Younger. Pre-adolescent. Pre-pre-adolescent. Pre-pre- whatever, whatever the words are. I can't remember. Whatever. Uh, I think that's gonna be. Uh, I think that's gonna do it for this uh, for this episode episode two. So, I'm gonna save here. Let's see how long uh, we've been going for. Forty-seven minutes. Save. I keep pressing the wrong one. There. There we go. So. I shall see you next time, and as always, peace.